this and now. Going again with that neck breaker. And now what's Sherman going to do here? Oh, what a springboard. Moonsault with Cocabana. Catching them off. Catching Sherman off guard with that sneaky pin. And now. Sherman. Going with the suplex. And now. Oh, tell me. The three amigos. He got it. And now to the top rope. A1090. The cover. That's it. What a victory here by Slashing Sherman. Very impressive in this non-title matchup. Here are your winners. And I'm wondering the superstar. who in the hell are going to challenge the these two at Thug Life? That is my question. Who is willing to step up to the plate? Because I haven't seen this kind of you know, lack of trying to go after these titles since Exotica and Zodiac were the tag team champions. I wait, what the? Sky? Oh, man. Has been? What? Oh, man. Necessary war brings pain, but war is necessary. War brings peace, cause war is necessary. Get your warriors up, cause my niggas are war ready. War brings hate, esco, 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 esco. Cause war is necessary. War brings pain, esco, esco. Get your warriors up, cause my niggas are war ready. My niggas war ready. at the face of my watch is like a crystal ball with the ability to make the issue stall. I told my man duck, cause I know where the missile fall. Cause the ice is a fortune teller for the rich or small. Went to my man crib and dead and saw his picture fall. I picked it up, his voice whispered nigga ball. So I smoked the finest, 85 for the ocean liners. I do it for the have nots, a match spots that resemble screensavers on your laptops. And niggas can't believe it like seeing that niggas ad drop. I be in Cameroon, bandanas on silk to y'all. Sip cream, liqueur, green and blue, feel up a lot. Suits, ball smooth, only thing that I endorse through Stash house is gamble, I don't swear to lost through All true and living God, we was oh, I heard that. Let's go, man oh. Let's go I'm gonna give y'all something Let's go And we're back in the... What the? Damn! Ruby Carter attacking Lana Star. What? To the collective. And Lana Star trying to fight back. I don't think anyone wants to be a part of this collective thing. And I mean, it's already infected SCA. It's already infected ACW. God damn. And uh, someone's got to put a stop to this. I mean, come on now. Someone's got to put a stop to this. Or otherwise, the collector's going to have another member to add to their... to their association. Where is security out here? I mean, come on now. I'm on, we don't want this collective thing to, to, to infect XGWL as well. I mean, they've already infected, like I said. Man. Ruby Carter is just, just really going after Lena Star here. 
Damn. We're security. Man, we gotta, well, we gotta get to this next matchup here. Well, the XGW Up to Setup title will really... I, I really hope security has... I'm just speechless. Approaching the ring from Japan. I mean, I can't really focus into this matchup because of what's been happening. The samurai. I mean, what's been happening in the back with Ruby Carter, first going after Cheerleader Melissa, and now Lana Star. But uh, I'm being told that I have to just. But I have to focus on this matchup here. Uh, Alright, here comes Mike Mexico trying to recapture that XGW El Crucero title. This collective thing, if anything, I have a feeling that the collective is going to have themselves a new member. I guess their own will. I know Ruby Carter was taken against her will, and now she's been enslaved by this collective thing. It's ridiculous, Holmes. I just really know how V13 is able to get to Ruby Carter at Global Warning when this first happened. But anyways, let's get to this matchup here. As Dragon Boy, with a new look to him, Going all black and red instead of his usual green. And a face rusher right there by Mike Mexico. And I must say, <laughs> Dragon Boy, I mean, I mean, no matter what his attire looks like, he, he's still the same high-flying specialist, that, that amazing high-flyer that made him a now four-time XGW World Crusado Champion. And now, Mike Mexico... Hits him with a bulldog. And now punch right there. More of an uppercut. And now Mike Mexico with a go behind. And Dragon Boy counters. The aura. Counter. With a headlock. Oh! Damn! <laughs> what combination right there now. Uh, that... Handspring backflip splash. And a punch right there by Dragon Boy. Counter by Mike Mexico in the European uppercut. And now counter with an elbow. And now Dragon Boy with a submission holding. What's Chad Miller doing on the ring apron? Man, Chandler needs to get off that r damn ring apron. Referee giving him a warning. If he doesn't, I think if he... Because I know referee is a little strict on on these... On all these people who are at ringside and on behalf of somebody that if they interfere enough, they'll, that the, the referee will throw them out of the matchup. And a kick right there. And I'm not too sure about this whole going the count right there. It's not even a one count. And now, what a standing moonsault by Dragon Boy with an elevation and damn. <laughs> nice arm drag. And now Dragon Boy going to the top bro. And and Mike Mexico swats him away. And now, what else are we going to see from these two? Sleeper hold. Dragon Boy is trying to go with a more of a technical style here. And again, Chad Miller on that ring apron. And what a spinny heel kick by Mike Mexico. Oh. A referee throwing Chad Miller out of ringside. But finally going to be a one-on-one -on -one match. And thank God, too, because Chad Miller was causing too much of a distraction at ringside. 
try to help Mike Mexico cheat. I know they will. And now, nice arm ringer by Dragon Boy and followed up by a leg drop to the arm. And now again with this handspring back, backflip splash. And now, with submission hold, very dangerous submission hold. With Mike Mexico knowing that getting out of, out of it as quick, quick as possible. And now Irish Whip ducks underneath. Hits him with a face buster. 